guys, Andy here. We are doing the July, I know it's a little late, the Ipsy Glam Bag, the $12 bag. It just came in today. I know it's in August already. It got held up at my post office for a couple days because I just moved. So I am very sorry, but I'm here to get this up. Hopefully nothing like that will happen anymore in the future. I know people have been having issues with shipping and things like that anyway, so at least it came the first Monday. You know, it's only the second, so we're going to get into it. So again, like I said, this is the Glam Bag. This is the $12 a month subscription, and this month was Stay Golden. Here's the bag with the little charm. And then I got a couple things outside of my bag that I'll save for the end because they are add-ons. I don't mind this bag. It's the inside's blue, very pretty. It's kind of like it's not plasticky, but it's something that could be like easily wiped down and like the color's cute. I don't know if I'll necessarily keep I only keep like the really, really pretty bags that I use for like travel and things like that. So let's get the card out. So again, yep, the theme is stay golden. And this goes over, in the small bag, this one, it goes over your products, gives a little blurb about them, how much the full pro full size price would cost. You get five, generally they're sample size products, you do get some full size every now and again. You do get to choose one product for your bag, and I will just start off with the product that I chose for this month, because it is the thing I am most excited about. Um... Did you guys, did anyone else get their box late? Did you have issues with shipping? I know there's been a lot that people have not been happy about with Ipsy. I'm just opening the product. Let me know down below. I haven't had any issues, but, you know, to each their own. So for this month, I went ahead, I picked the Grace and Stella foaming face wash and this is two ounces so like this is a good like for a sample this is like a deluxe size the full size of this is $16 which is not bad I'm gonna go ahead and unscrew it just to see if it has a scent it just smells like hand soap like original no scented hand soap. So the little blurb says this gentle, ah, it's a fragrance free cleanser. So that's why it just smells like cleanser, which is great. I do not like added fragrance unless it's coconut. But my skin, it's kind of sensitive. I have redness and rosacea and I have acne prone, oily skin, but generally scents don't bother me, but it's just, it's so unnecessary in your skincare. So it says it's everything you want in a fluffy, foamy, fresh face wash. It'll remove any dirt, excess oil, and impurities without leaving your face feeling tight or dry because it has hyaluronic acid and aloe vera in it. It says you can use it morning and night. I'm very excited. I'm almost done with my current face wash. So this is going to go right in as soon as I'm done. So that's our first sample. Now we got a squeezy tube. This is the Mystique Hydro Serum. This is a hydro hair serum. So let's see. So this is, full size of this is $17. There's only 10 milliliters in here. There's 125 in the full size. So it says it's suitable for all hair types. It's non-greasy and non-sticky gel serum. It provides long lasting hydration from flaxseed, protection from heat and UV damage thanks to antioxidants and lightweight definition and hold. Apply to damp or dry hair before heat styling to prevent damage on split ends. I probably won't be using this, but my profile is still set up from when I had a little bit longer hair, so I can't really complain about getting this, but my boyfriend, fiance, Ian, he has really long hair and he has really frizzy split ends. He works in a, fat, in a hot factory all day, so I will, I'll use this on his hair. And he will just deal with it. Yeah. Let's see. Ooh, we got another squeezy tube. Oh, and it's in plastic. Normally things aren't in their plastic or boxes and things still. But 
these products are. How do I open you? Well, anywho, I'll get it open in a second. This is the Glow on 5th Chamomile Hand Cream. Ooh. So for 60 grams is $38 full size. So this is half. So this is a $15 sample. So this paid for your box, technically. Um, it just says, try transform your dry hands with this cute little cream. Smooths rough rough texture with gentle acids it soothes and nourishes with antioxidant rich green tea extract and it has a refreshing cooling feel that your skin will love use it on dry areas to moisturize beyond your hands think your knees elbows and heels Ooh, so it does have a safety seal which we love i love like balms like this where it's not just a hand cream um i get a lot of like there's some like lip balm products that you can use on your cuticles and your rough bits as well. So let's see. Let's just, it's just white. Oh, the scent is so faint of chamomile. Oh, it smells like soft, warm blankies. Oh, I love that. I'm going to put that next to my bed. I literally just ran out of hand cream. So I'm very happy. If I could get a lotion sample of some sort in every box i'd be here for that let's see we got another squeezy tube we're, we're on the squeezy tube track so this is from first aid beauty this is the pores be gone matte primer so full size of this for 1.7 ounces is 30 dollars this is 0.34 ounces Ooh, it says it's oil free safe for sensitive skin it's got fig extract in it so it says it's a mattifying face primer it will create a smooth base for any foundation concealer or tinted moisturizer for a crease proof finish well i will give that to the test because i am currently wearing this is the benefit no pore uh the pore professional hydrating primer and it doesn't matter what pore filling or smoothing primer I use I still get my smile lines you can see so and I get like I'll get the little crease around my nose here so I'll definitely try it out let's see if it smells so this didn't have a safety seal which we know how we feel about that but ooh, I smell cucumber yeah, like that cucumber melon lotion, that's what this smells like. But it went on. It's really soft and smooth. I feel like it matted my hand a little bit. It's not as shiny as over here. So that felt nice. I'll try it. I'm all for more primers. I have way too many, uh, but I'm all for it. And last but not least, we got something in some bubble wrap here. Gimme. We have, so this is also from Sophia, and, oh, not also, this is from Sophia and Maybell. This is the eyeshadow quad. It's the Cleopatra palette. So full size of this is $18. It says the shadow quad is here to help you turn up the glam. The golden and chocolate tone shades are highly blendable, super pigmented, and true to pan. There's one matte and three shimmers. Uh, I'd prefer if it were three mattes and one shimmer. The packaging's pretty. It's like a baby doll pink. So let's see. There is what the palette looks like. I mean, it is pretty. I don't personally like these tiny little palettes, but let's give it a swatch. Ooh, all right. That shimmer's beautiful. I'm probably about to eat my words. Let's see. Okay. It's a little dark for what I normally wear as I'm wearing black and blue, blue eyeshadow. But when I'm reaching for neutrals, these are a little bronzier than I typically go. But these are super soft. They were super pigmented. I'm not mad about it. I will definitely give it a try. I really liked this box. 
so again, the, the theme was the Stay Golden. We went ahead, we got the foaming face wash, hair serum, pore filling primer, chamomile hand cream, and the little eyeshadow quad. What did you think of this month's box? I liked it. I would have liked a little bit more makeup, but I'm not complaining about any of the samples that I got. Let me know, what did you guys think of your boxes, bags? Let me know down below, because I would love to hear what you got. Are you excited for August? What did I choose? I chose a uh, lip oil, so I'm, I'm very excited to get that next month. Now, I just have two things of add-ons here. Last month, not last month, June, because, you know, it's August. They sent me a concealer in the wrong shade for my skin tone, so they gave me points. And then I already had some points saved up, so I went ahead and I got... <laughs> I didn't know I was getting that hand cream, so I got the La Chatelaine. Is I think how you pronounce that? It's the coconut milk hand cream. It's 20% shea butter. So let's open her up. This one also has a safety seal. So this was, I believe, like 600 points in the store, and so was the other item I got. I know I don't need both hand creams open, but whichever scent I like better is the one I'll probably stick with using, and I'll just put the other one in my little backup drawer. That didn't want to come off. Okay. So this is definitely a thicker lotion, hand cream. Wow. Yeah, that is thick. You really have to rub that out. Oh, but it smells like coconut and I love coconut. Super soft, super smoothing. I don't know which lotion I want to use first. I feel like it, it, this isn't going to last until when it gets colder out, but like that's what this would be really nice for because it's such a thick hand cream. And honestly, since it's a smaller sample, I'll probably just use this one first, but sucker for lotions. And then the other thing I got was a set of sheet masks. I love this brand. It's the Cream Shop. I love, I especially love their sheet masks. So I went ahead and got the Coconut and Chia Mask. So the coconut moisturizes dry skin, reduces inflammation, has healing properties, and prevents breakouts. And the chia seed side is rich in omega-3 fatty acids, regulates oil production, exfoliates dead skin scales, and strengthens the skin barrier. All sounds like things that I need for my face. And then it came with the rose gold mask as well, which the rose side is soothing and calming. It hydrates and revitalizes tired skin, astringent properties to help reduce oil production. And then the gold side says stimulates skin cells for improved circulation, intense brightening, and increases skin elasticity for suppleness. And so, like, it's the fusion sheet mask, the two benefits of two masks in one. And this one was a special edition. They were getting rid of this on the shop. So that's why I went with these ones, because they also had, one was blueberry, and I think one was banana. Like, one was a blueberry and cream, one was a bananas and cream. But I've had those before, and they were fine. But I figured, these all sound like things I need for my skin. I love having sheet masks on hand. Because I much prefer sheet masks over, like, the cream wash-off masks. I just, I hate having to put them on and then you wait and you've got to go rinse them off. Whereas I can just take the sheet mask off, rub the serum in and be done. So, but tip for someone like me who's hot all of the time. Put your sheet masks. I mean, you should be putting a lot of your skincare in the fridge, but I don't have one of those cute little skincare fridges. Well, put your sheet masks, put your eye gels, your roller balls, put them in the fridge. At least they say like an hour before you're going to use them, at least. And they'll be cooling when they go on your face. And they're, it's just, it's so much refreshing, especially with it being so hot this summer. It's beautiful. So I would definitely recommend that tip. So again, leave me comments down below on what you got, how you guys are feeling. If you have used any of these products and want to leave, you know, for people down below how you used them, 
how they work for you, I would appreciate it. And Wednesday's video will be my long-awaited empties from the last seven months. So that's going to be a quite a long video. So I will see you guys on Wednesday. Bye.